All right, can I get everyone in the back, everyone around here, a big announcement, please? As you all know, you gave us your suggestions on how we can boost morale in the workplace. There's obviously a unanimous decision with the suggestions because all of these papers say the same thing. Since this is obviously what you all want, we're going to allow it. Of course, I'm talking about something that y'all refer to as server purge day. Yes! Finally! Okay, guys, 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 you still can't do anything illegal. No stealing, no hitting. So this is one day that you can say what you want and respond how you want with no repercussions from me. Are you kidding? I don't ever want to hear. I don't do anything for y'all. I can't wait! I, I, I don't know what to do with myself. Oh my god, I'm gonna freak out. I'm gonna cry. What am I now, right? What can I get y'all to drink? Um, four waters for the kids, um, extra lemon, and I can go ahead and tell you we're gonna need extra sugar for the table. So, four lemonades? No, we both know that water is free and lemon and sugar is complimentary. Well, if I'm bringing you enough lemons and sugar to make lemonade, I'm charging you for lemonade. <laughs> no, you can't do that. Oh, today I can. So I am telling you, I'm charging you for lemonade. Would you like to make that lemonade yourself or would you like for me to bring it to you? But I just don't really- mm, Don't even know why I gave you a choice. I'm just gonna bring you lemonade because I'm not cleaning up all your lemon rinds and sugar packets. Excuse me? Ma'am. Yes, ma'am. You brought my quesadilla out with sour cream. I did not want sour- mm, Let me stop you right there. I didn't do shit. I'm not your server. Oh. I know. Us working folk all look the same to you. No, no, no. I mean, you're all wearing the same thing. Your sour cream is literally on the side, separate from everything else on the plate. Just don't fucking eat it. All right, come on, kids. Let's go. Oh, hang on, hang on. Slow your roll. You're leaving? Uh, yeah. We paid. We're done eating. Oh, and you're just gonna leave this fucking mess? That's disgusting. Well, it's your job to clean it. <laughs> no, sir. I work my 213's worth, and that does not include getting on my hands and knees for your little crumb snatchers mess of broken chips, rice, boogers, and drool. Crumb snatchers? And, matter of fact, you're the one that let them make that mess. They're kids. And you're comfortable leaving that biohazard for a stranger to clean up? Ugh. Disgusting. I'm gonna get you a rag. You are messy, kid. You know? Y'all are not being as bad as I thought y'all were gonna be. I thought I really outdid myself. I mean, I was expecting y'all to be throwing things, name calling. Well, it's not too late to make that happen. It's more like y'all are just trying to teach these people how to be decent. Hello everyone, welcome. My name is Mary. Sweet tea, no lemon. Guacamole for the table. We on a time crunch today or something? What? Couldn't wait on the six second introduction, you know, know my name so you know how you can ask for shit. I don't care. You bring the food. Okay. Well, if you're not going to show me basic respect, why do you think I would show you basic respect and put effort into your experience and your meal? Well, don't you want a tip? Yeah, y'all really get off on thinking you hold that power over us, don't you? We don't care to miss out on the $2 you're going to leave. I would much rather not get a tip but still be treated like a person than be disrespected and shit on for pocket change. Is that so? Then I can just take my pocket change elsewhere. Wonderful. Goodbye. Hi there, folks. What drinks could I get started for you? Mm, bring me your hot tea list. Oh my fucking god. Okay, just get out. Excuse me? It's like a litmus test. You are going to be too high maintenance and too annoying. You have to have a, a chamomile. Any hot tea you're going to get is just unsweet tea that I put in the microwave. Excuse me, could, could we get a table? Oh, sure, yeah, just as long as you know today is server purge day, so all the servers are allowed to talk back. We know, we came to watch y'all pop off on some Karens. Oh, perfect, yeah, um, the viewer section is right along the back wall. It's a minimum of a $20 tab to keep your seat. Oh, kick ass, thanks. Enjoy. I want the deluxe burrito. All right, would you like chicken or beef? Half shredded chicken, half grilled chicken. No tomatoes, extra guacamole. I want cheese dip instead of burrito salsa, and the sour cream needs to be inside, not on top. And I expect to be charged for the price listed here. Well, the extra guacamole and the grilled chicken both have enough charge. Well, I do know the owner, so it really shouldn't be. Oh my god, she knows the owner. We've got a friend of the owner, everybody. Make some noise. Yeah. Yeah. Inspirational. No Can I shake your hand? She knows the person who owns the place. I know you too. Do you know what that means? That means that you get to get the fuck out. Woo. Get out, Ooh. We don't fucking care. Get up, get up, get out. Get out, get out, get out. Yeah, it is pretty wild.
wobbly. Um, let me, let me see what I can do. This is fucking ridiculous. Well, I think I can just prop the wiggly and... <laughs> Dang, give me a heads up, man. I'm so sorry, um, but is that any better? Did you prop up the right side of the table? This is worse. Okay, let me take those... Ooh. What the hell are you doing? The heck was that for? Did you forget what today is? Why are you letting him talk to you like that? But like the table is like legitimately wobbly and I think I'm I don't give a shit. Who knows if we're ever gonna have another day like this again? It's not like you made the table wobbly. He can have some patience. Seriously, you need to go back and let him have it. You done gossiping with your girlfriends? The table's still wobbly. You know, you should really be nicer to the people who handle your food. Or what, you're gonna spin in it? I know you'd lose your job. Well, that would only happen if I were to get caught. I'd like to see you try it. I see all these cameras around here. But I, I work here. You think I wouldn't know all the blind spots? I know every camera in this place. I know all the angles. I know all the spots that aren't covered. And there's three of those spots, just from the kitchen window to your table. Do you know how I know that? Because I basically fucking live here. But you're right. I probably don't want to risk my job just to, like, spit in a rude customer's food. I figured as much. But you don't know me. You know, you've eaten a lot of salsa today. So many textures in that salsa. You'd never be able to tell if we put anything in there. Fingernails. Boogers. Scabs. Spit. Ugh. And I can think of a couple other bodily fluids that are completely missable in that beer of yours. Or in the sauce that's on your burrito. No, that, that's illegal. You can't be putting- Hmm, but how would you know? Tell me. How would you know? You wouldn't. You may belittle me and stiff me on the tip, but believe me, I know how to get the last laugh if I want it. But lucky for you, I'm not the person to do that. I just don't have the heart for it. But you don't know that. So just remember this, the next time you want to be an ass to your server. You know what? I, I, think, I think I'm done. Come back, come back, come back. Oh my god, dude, you need to go take a Hello, look. and welcome to the restaurant. Before I get started with any information for a table, I do need to let you know that today is a purge day for our employees, so everyone is allowed to respond how they see fit, and energies will be matched. Also, our viewing section has increased from $20 a seat to $50 a seat. So how can I help you today? Okay, um, how long for a table of five? And for a party of five, it's looking to be about an hour, maybe 45 minutes so we can make someone mad enough to leave. An hour? Are you freaking kidding me? Are you freaking kidding me? You just had to fight your way to get to the host stand through a crowd of people. You think you're gonna get sat right away? I told you the right time. Now you give me a name or you leave. Oh, trust me, we'll be leaving. You won't be getting any business from us. Oh no, what are we gonna do without your business? I mean, oh wait, our restaurant is still packed and we have an hour long wait. Get bent. Hi, uh, we were told that the wait was gonna be 20 minutes. It's already been 45. No, it fucking hasn't, Beth. No one has been told a 20 minute wait time and it hasn't been 45 minutes. Try 15. I tried. Not gonna work on her. How long's the wait for two people? It's about 45 minutes right now. Okay, well what happens if it's longer than 45 minutes? Well, I do hope you'd be an adult about it and realize that I am not a fortune teller and this is just an estimate and the pace at which tables are sat has nothing to do with me and everything to do with how long the guests that are already here decide to stay. That's fair. Wonderful. So would you like to put your name down? Yeah, uh, Paul. Thank you so much, Paul. And feel free to order from the bar while you wait for your name to be called. Hi, we were told 35 minutes. Well, it's getting close to 25 minutes now. Okay, and 25 minutes is not 35 minutes, is it? No. So why are you up here? Go sit down. You know, I think you'd do a lot better if you smiled. Oh, that was stupid. I'm just saying, I think she'd look a lot prettier if she maybe smiled. I will end you. My soup is ice cold. How could you give me this disgusting cold soup? No, 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 no. You and I both know that you specifically asked for that soup to come out with your meal when I offered to bring it as an appetizer. Okay, but I just- Now look at you. You ate your whole entree leaving that soup untouched and you're gonna yell at me like I did something wrong? Okay. I'm sorry. Okay. Could I please have a warm soup? Sure. Now would you like a fresh one made or do you want me to just heat this one up? Oh, um, a fresh one would be fantastic. Well, too bad. I really only asked you that to teach you a lesson. Had you been nicer, I absolutely would have had a fresh one made because this takes like no time to make it all. But you were rude to me. So this is going in the microwave. 
whatever. So remember this, and be better. Okay, are we ready to order? Yeah, I mean, there's just one dish I get at this restaurant I go to all the time, and y'all just don't seem to have it. Well, we are a different restaurant. Yeah, but that's just, that's just something I was really wanting. Then fucking go there, I don't give a shit. Uh, excuse me? Hello? Okay, so I do have a question. Yeah, what's up? Does the quesadilla have cheese in it? <sighs> what's wrong? Okay, I really don't want to do this to you, but it's purge day, so I don't know when I'm going to get another opportunity. Oh, um, yeah, okay. Like, seriously, you haven't done anything wrong. You've been great. Well, well, thank you. Like, truly, you've been really polite. You've been really easy. This just really grinds my gears. Oh, well, I'm so sorry for whatever I did. Oh, no, don't be. Um, okay. I mean, you'll see what I'm talking about. It's so fucking stupid. This is probably the only time I can say anything about it. No, 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 no. I get it. I get it. Go ahead. Okay. I'm sorry. What are you dipping your chips in? Mm, queso. Yeah, queso. What is queso? Cheese. Mm hmm So queso is cheese. So queso dia. Oh, duh. Like a cheese dia. More or less, yeah. Well, now I just feel silly. <laughs> no, no, no. I get that question all the time and I know it's not a big deal. It's just really annoying. No, no, no. You're totally fine. It's a special day. I totally get it. I promise. Yeah. Well, thank you. Oh, no problem. I hope you were able to get it out of your system. <laughs> I did. Seriously. Thank you. Yeah, for sure. For sure. So, did you want a quesadilla? Oh, no, uh, I'm actually lactose intolerant. Um, You're eating case. What the? Oh my god. Alright, is everything looking okay, folks? Um, everything's good. Good, good. Could I get anyone anything? Uh, no, thank you. Do you work here? I mean, yeah, of course. Well, what are you wearing? It's purge day. Oh, that's right. Um, okay, ma'am, here is your card back. I hope you'll have a great rest of your day and come back and see us. Um, excuse me, ma'am? Yes. I am not sure what kind of pin this is. <laughs> uh, here's the kind of pin you need. Okay. Was that what I thought it was? You know, purge day. <laughs> right. So I can't get in trouble today, it's just a joke. Right. I, I am just so silly. Mm hmm So silly. Yeah, so have a good one. Man, I shouldn't have said anything. I should have just kept it. And a lot of people were really excited about today, so they can like yell at people and stuff. Mm hmm I just want to stay warm, drink my tea. You know, just be comfortable while I'm working, and I can't get in trouble today, so why not? Okay, that's a that's a different way to take advantage of the day. Okay. Hey, dude. What's up? It's getting kind of chill in here, you know? Uh, so I'll give you 20 bucks if you snap at one of the waitresses. Dude, no. They hate that. Oh, please, dude. It'd be so funny. Okay, fine. Hey, lady. I know you did not just snap at somebody. Oh my Get god. Get the fuck out. Oh shit. I have been waiting <laughs> on this. Do you think you're fucking funny, asshole? I'm, I'm sorry it was, it was for a prank. I think I'm gonna kick his ass. I'm Today of all days, do you wanna snap your fucking fingers? You tell him you put me up yeah, to it, bad. He put me up to it. Ass. Get the hell out of here. We don't have time for shit like this. Can I pay my bill up here? Hmm. Of course. Am I interrupting your break? You think we get breaks? Even if we did, it's purge day. I'm not missing a thing. So because it's your little made-up holiday, you can just snack and do whatever you want in front of customers? Because you saw me take a sip of water? <laughs> Silly me, I forgot to turn off my bodily functions when I clocked in today. I'm not allowed to feel thirsty, you're hungry, or need to go to the bathroom, right? Not for the whole 10 hours I'm here, right? <sighs> here we go. Still trying to turn off that setting that makes me cry when people yell at me. All I really need is customer service and breathing, right? Well, I hope y'all are having fun today. I hope it's still funny when you see that I won't leave you a tip. Oh, you don't have to. I already added a 25% gratuity. Bye. Um, can I have a coffee before you bring me my check? Oh, uh, sorry. We actually just used the last of our coffee. Oh, uh, well, I don't mind waiting for more to be brewed. Well, I don't really feel like making anymore. What? It's like so, such a hassle. I just, I just hate doing it. What? It's just annoying. I'm like, go somewhere else. Hey, miss. You want to bring me some chips that are worth a damn? Can 
gonna get a table with some fucking manners. Y'all's parking lot is tiny. How do you expect guests to get in here when you have so little spots available? You need a bigger parking lot. Look at me. Do you think I give a singular shit about the parking lot? Mm, better question. Do you think I could even do anything about the parking lot? Well, if I tell you, then you tell your higher ups. Lady, we work here so we have a place to live and so we can sustain whatever kind of substance addiction we have from working here. In the famous words of my first and favorite manager, Fabri, you can leave a suggestion at our hotline. Okay. The number is 1-800-GO-FUCK-YOURSELF. Oh! Hello, hope y'all are doing okay. Can I get y'all started with something to drink? Uh, we want to sit at a different table. Uh, okay. We want that one. Yeah, that big one in the back. Uh, the large booth that seats eight for the two of you. Yeah. You can just grab the minis and silverware. We're just gonna scoot on over there. Man, we actually keep that table open for larger parties and we're actually about to hit our dinner rush. Well, no one's there now. Correct, but we are about to hit our dinner rush and that is one of our only tables that can accommodate a large party. I think it's fine if we sit there. Uh, this table's too small anyway. Ma'am, the two of you are at a table that comfortably seats four. We do not put small parties at that large table. I didn't realize it was so complicated seating people at tables. Your job must be so hard. You know what? What? You know, I think it's been about a year. Hey guys, you know it's been a year since we've done our purge day? Are we doing that again? What day? What, what did she say? What do you think? You think we should do it again? Okay, it's back on. Yes! Purge day! I'll clean that up later, but you never tip and you always leave your chewed fingernails on the bar! Disgusting. What in the world? Great, it is officially purge day again. I don't even know what that means. Oh, you missed last year? Oh, it was a hit. Well, anyway, it just means that I can respond how I see fit and essentially just stop having to bite my tongue when it comes to customers. Because we asked to move tables? No, because you asked to move to the big table. So I'll explain again. The big table holds this many. And you guys are this many. Okay, and this is really that big of a deal to you? Uh, no it is not, actually. You are just both very stubborn and rude, so I have no desire to be accommodating to you, so... See ya. Hey there, how's it going? Fine. Great, what can I get you- Ew, this fork has food on it! Oh, yuck, I'm sorry about that. Let me go grab you a new roll of silverware. <laughs> and you're sure you're not gonna bring me another fork with food on it? Why would I- What- what kind of question even is that? Well, you already brought me one nasty fork, so that tells me you probably have a whole bin of filthy silverware that you would pull a new fork from. Yeah, you're right. We purposely keep all of our silverware dirty. You should just eat with your hands. <laughs> yeah. Or you could just leave. Here you go, sir. You know, you're making it hard for me to not want to give you all my money. Ah, oh, come on now. You know what you're doing. The way you turn around and prance off after bringing me my beer. Excuse me? If you want my money, just say so, baby. I can give it to you, if you make it worth my while. After your shift, if you know what I mean. Shame on you! Hey, that was my drink! Uh, yeah, m my drink's still in my hand. Oh, my bad. Will you stop smacking those freaking cups? Hey! That was slimy as fuck, dude. You deserve that. Hey! You're cleaning both of those messes, and you? Get whatever you want, it's on me. Hello, we need a table for three. Hey, um, sorry, we close in like four minutes. Okay, don't even start with that. In four minutes is not now. So you're not closed now. Okay, right this way. Um, you know what? I actually have a better table than this one, follow me. Oh, well, okay. Okay, table's right here. Great, thank you. Oh, uh, you know, this table looks kind of dirty. Why don't you follow me? Oh. Okay. Oh, this table is perfect. Seriously? This was the first table. Oh, is it? Well, why don't you have a seat? <sighs> Would you look at that? What? We're closed. I'm going to have to ask you and your party to leave. 
Are you kidding? No, ma'am, not at all. That's not fair. <sighs> don't even start. You didn't even try to get here on time. We are closed now.